Hey folks, thanks for tuning in. Uh, today we're talking about how, how to wire up this uh, transparent OLED display. We get a lot of questions on how do I hook this up to our Arduino. And, uh, well, you can't plug it directly into an Arduino because Arduinos don't have zip sockets. Not only that, there are some components and some other wirings that you're going to have to put in place before you can plug it into your Arduino. So, I'm going to try to explain it the best I can, but I'm not an engineer. So if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and I'll get someone more qualified than me to answer your questions. So first off, we've got pins. If you look here closely, I'll try to bring this in closer. In a way that you can see. Right there. We've got pins one, two, three. And if you flip it over, a wire, jumping over to 24 in the back, all wired to ground. That's where we first start. And then there's a 4.7 microfarad tantalum resistor between pin 22 and ground at 25 volts, which I don't know if you'll be able to see that very well. Yep, right there. And then you're going to need a 0.1 microfarad and a 10 microfarad resistor between pin 23 and ground pin 24, which is actually these pins here. You just can't see that because they're actually this side, but that's right there. And then there's a 0.1 microfarad and a 4.7 microfarad between ground and pin 5 at 10 volts which is soldered in there although you can't really see it very well again and you can find all this information on the data sheet on page six and we also uh, referenced uh, a similar breakout board um, that will fit this if connector perfectly that you can purchase on Amazon, Alibaba, DigiKey, wherever you like Right. If you have any other questions or comments, leave them below or contact us at support at crystalfonts.com and uh, we'll have an engineer answer your questions. Thanks for watching.